YouTube, it's me, Jen, your Pudgy Picker, here in my kitchen. This is as far as I got dragging in things that I found dumpster diving today. If this is your first time uh, stopping in on my channel, thanks for checking in. Um, I do all kinds of videos here. Uh, I'm a reseller on eBay as well as having an antique booth. And I do this kind of as a fun thing. I donate a lot of the things that I find. But let's jump right in and show you all the goodies that I got. So this stack here, <laughs> there are 16 of these polar seltzer waters that are the flavor like mermaid kisses. They're for little kids. They're like regular cans of pop, but they're just shorter. I actually do like seltzer, seltzer water, so I uh, will probably keep most of these. Um, and then this one is unicorn kisses. Oh, mermaid song, that's what it is. And there are, let's see, eight of those. So yeah, those are pretty cool. I will drink those. Um, down here, I did not bring in everything. I only found one case of Diet Coke. I found seven cases, just like this one, of regular Coke. I went ahead and transferred it to my husband's car because he has a friend that drinks regular Coke. So that is where that will go. So you'll just have to trust me on that one because I'm like, I'm not going to drag all those in just for the video. Um, these were in a craft store. They were in their original bags, but the bags were dirty. These are pillow inserts, so I went ahead and grabbed those. There's nothing wrong with them. They look perfectly good and clean. Um, I believe this was from the same store. These are little, like, gift bags where you can make things out of them. A uh, whole stack of them. There is this tube of, uh, what is it, Cricut? Yeah, Cricut uh, Holographic Sparkle Iron-On Mosaic. My uh, sister Kim actually has a Cricut. Look at that, $8.97 marked down. Nothing wrong with it. Still shrink-wrapped. Did get a few more magazines. Uh, you probably remember my last haul. I got a big box of them. Um, let me just move this. These are some brushes. This one's open, so I didn't know if it had something with it. I will look through these if they're worth selling or not. There's two of these. Um, crochet Mandela kit is included. So there's two of those. Um, there's this uh, crochet hat kit. And then, let's see. Uh, creative stamping and then crochet. So yeah, I'll look through those, see if they're worth anything, but not too bad of a pickup. Got a whole handful of uh, pencils. It looked like the box had broken open, so they just tossed them. Uh, this cute little teddy bear, um, a roll of stickers, uh, three of these magnetic um, uh, clips. Uh, this is pretty cool. It uh, is a cutting mat did get it at a craft store. It did have another part on the bottom so you could cut and then turn this and then cut. That part came off, but this is perfectly fine, never been used. Uh, some of these, I've never seen little two packs of the Oreo cookies. So there's four of those. Um, these were a little bit crushed. The other ones were broken. Um, I do donate to a pantry bin. It's just a pantry on the side of the road. You could just put stuff in or take stuff out. So those will go in there as well as these. Uh, the store that had these, it was a three-pack and one was missing, so those will uh, go as well. This smells so good. <laughs> it's like a cinnamon, I don't know, pumpkin kind of deal. Uh, wax melt. This works. I tried it already. It is a huge stamp. Um, and then this camel from Ty, which my daughter noticed that it has some paint on it, but it could probably be scratched off because it is dry. Isn't he cute? Um, got a sprig of lavender and then this, uh, uh, I don't know what you call it, like a succulent with a very long stem. Um, I got a whole bunch of books uh, at a drugstore that uh, was just throwing them out. Of course, they tear off the front so you can't resell them. Um, I will donate most of these uh, specifically to a few people that I know that like to read, and especially these uh, few authors I know, um, a friend that likes those. There's even a, uh, I think there's even a Stephen King one in there as well. These were also out of the craft store. Um, they are the uh, canvas. 
there's a huge package of them. There's 10. But this is why they were thrown out. Somebody uh, poked a hole in two of them. So my daughter's an artist, so she'll take those out and she will use them. So that entire thing was thrown away. Uh, these were in a grocery store dumpster. I already washed them up. Um, so yeah, they're in perfectly good condition. Um, I got three chocolate bars, divine uh, caramel dark, dark chocolate. Uh, I got two of these. I did open this one just so you could see what is inside, but they are the same thing. They are Hickory Farms. This has crackers, two summer sausages, a uh, cheese, and a uh, sweet hot mustard, and then some of the little candies that look like strawberries. So those were in there. There's two of those. There was four boxes of moon pies. <laughs> My mother used to love those. Um, these were marked down but didn't sell. Uh, they are individually wrapped little brioche uh, mini swirls. So three packages of those. We have four of the Giardelli, Gier, Giardelli, something like that. <laughs> Milk chocolate caramel. There are four of those. Some hard candy. Um, I guess it's like spearmint. These, I'm not sure how these are going to be. They, uh, I don't know, the bag kind of looks a little crushed. But these are Carolina Kettle uh, barbecue potato chips. And then two jars of this marjoram. I don't use marjoram, so another idea for the uh, pantry box. I will probably just donate those. So yeah, I didn't do too bad. Found some good stuff today, especially these. You know, it's nice to find stuff that you can use uh, or donate or give away, but it's awesome to find things that you can use. Definitely will be using these. A um, couple of the books, a lot of other things. Pretty cool. Saving it from the landfill and getting it to people who can really use it. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below. You can also uh, click the subscribe button. You can follow me for hauls like these out of dumpsters. I also do thrift store hauls, garage sale hauls, auction hauls. I also show you uh, booth tours of the current setup I have at my antique mall. All kinds of other fun stuff and maybe even a few DIYs sprinkled in there. So thanks again for tuning in. I will see you guys next time. And until then, happy picking. Bye.